Hi guys, it's Luke from Luke's Mushrooms. We have Saturday the 24th of June 2023. I'm in one of my most favorite oak forests in Czech Republic and I'm looking especially for some summer tips today. So let's start. This one was quite easy to spot and I believe it's a summer tip. Boletus reticulatus. Yes, it is Boletus reticulatus, already a slug eating the stem, but otherwise it feels firm and the shape is also nice and round. So this is a very nice beginning for today. And we should also check if it's healthy. So at first I will try to get the slug out. There are a few holes from worms, but there are not many, so this mushroom is basically healthy, which is great. Maybe 10 or 20 meters from the first one. We have a smaller one, but it's also very good looking. From this side there was some slug visiting it. Anyway, a very nice mushroom again. We are approaching the spot where almost one year ago we have found more than 30 summer tips at one spot. I hope you have seen the video because that was a legendary find. Here is the first one from this spot. A bigger one and it looks very good so it's not the only one that's what I can tell you already but I need to go very slowly to the others because I don't want to step on any of them here I can show you one more But this one is softer, looks a bit older. I will focus on uh, smaller and more fresh ones. So this one will stay here to spread some spores. This one is also a bit bigger, but still quite firm. And I think it's two of them next to each other. They are twins. So I will take this one. But as you can see, the color from the bottom side is a bit green. That means it's a bit older. Still quite firm, so the big one will be okay. And the small one doesn't look good actually. So the small one will be uh, cut off. Never mind. We continue further. Here is a smaller one and a very beautiful one. Look at this, this looks amazing. So the first of the small ones from here, the second from the small ones is this beauty. This is a perfect mushroom. It already looks very tasty and if you smell them the smell is awesome so second small one from here and there was one more I can already see it Another beauty. Last year they got smashed by slugs very quickly. These 
look also touched by slugs but looks much better than last time here I have some more uh, not sure if I will take them because these guys look a bit older uh, but I will show you so one and small one next to it these two will remain here the same for this one it's quite firm but the head is quite damaged and as I said I want to focus on the small and fresh ones a big guy here so these will stay here and up here I saw some more fresh ones that I will probably pick let's get there I also took a picture of this one looks amazing quite a big one still looks very fresh and firm there is a hole made by slug or a bug this one is a strong guy was lifting this fallen branch So looks perfect look at this spongy white very smooth bottom of the hat so these are some fantastic mushrooms here and we are still not done because I saw some more a bit further we need to get to them I was also taking a picture of one of them because it looked perfect maybe you can already see it I think this one is the nicest so far like all of them are beautiful but this one the shape is so regular so smooth even the color is perfect so yeah amazing and it has a brother here one is also beautiful so that's two young ones is there any more I know about one at least somewhere here Three perfect brothers. I will take them to the others. So 
so we can see all of them from this place together maybe arrange them a little bit look at these beautiful mushrooms here I think we should check if they are healthy so let's check the health we'll start from the side some worms here the hut will be okay there are just a few tiny holes as I mentioned also in my previous video it's very common that summer ceps have wormy stem and healthy head which is also the case of this one uh, actually not because this one is almost healthy also in the stem so that's great the most beautiful one was also the most healthy one so far let's continue with its same beautiful and same same healthy brother amazing mushroom this one is a bit more wormy but I don't want to cut the stem too much this will be still okay the smallest quite wormy actually in the stem that will be again okay this one is very wormy in the stem that will be okay check the stem of this bigger one very wormy in the stem hopefully something from the head will be usable we'll see I will cut the whole stem because it's it has many holes from slugs or something but the head seems to be completely healthy which is great this one is completely healthy so that's great as well wormy stem head could be usable so I will clean these a bit more maybe cut the half of the head to see and this is what we already have in the basket so really great start of the day here is a bigger one in a bad shape so I'm not taking this one it's quite heavily damaged and it's also quite huge so uh, that means it's probably older and without them being damaged uh, they look great of course but they are also very difficult to spot because they have often had of the same color as the leaves around for example this one I have only noticed because the head is a bit damaged from slugs on top not easy to pull out holds quite well but look how nice mushroom it is so sometimes it makes a good contrast to notice something white in between the leaves and those are actually the damaged parts of the head of this mushroom here is one more uh, with a uh, damaged head 
but I checked it before it looks very firm and hopefully it will be healthy from this side it looks so nice something bright here what can it be? Hmm, it's a beautiful summer sap. No surprise today. Today we really don't need to walk too much in the forest and cross long distances because we just came to the forest and they keep popping up, uh, popping up in every corner. So this is the time of the year which is really good for these mushrooms, for this species. I have seen one, a small one somewhere near and I can already see it. I took a picture of it, but I will not take it because it's very tiny. So I will cover it so it can hopefully grow bigger and maybe someone else will find it in the next days. I have also noticed that someone was here before because I found some cut it cut parts from from the same species of the mushroom so there are many of them today enough for everyone. This one has a interesting shape a bit deformed but I don't see any problem in that. Hopefully these two will be also healthy because they are good looking. So let's check. Wormy stem. So the hat will be okay again. That's the classic story for them. Also a bit wormy stem. The hat should be okay. There are also quite many russulas today. Various species. And some of them are probably edible and even tasty, but I don't pick russulas today. There is something else of my interest. For example, this beautiful summer sap. Another young and fresh piece. Then here are two older ones. I'm always happy to see more of them growing together. Some more russulas here. I believe these are the so-called almond russulas, at least how we call them here. And here I have seen one more summer sip but I almost stepped on these guys which are maybe some uh, xerocomelus or similar mushrooms here is the summer set that I mentioned bit bigger and bitten by slugs again but hopefully the head will be okay it is known that summer seps likes 
like to grow under oaks or ironwoods and some other species as well. Here under ironwood trees we have this guy. There is quite many ants around it. Small one, but it looks perfect. It's getting a bit more sunny. And I saw something here. Very firm. And this one was obviously growing very quickly because it got cracked, as you can see. But it doesn't change anything on the fact that it's, this is a beautiful and healthy looking summer tip again. Here we have some more. This one got bitten by slugs, but again Head should be okay, I believe. Here is a second one. A bit older because of this yellow greenish color tones in the bottom. And one awesomely colored here. And again, bitten by slugs quite much. But from this side, almost perfect. Seems like blushers are also starting in this forest. Beautiful two pieces. I'm not picking blushers today, but I would like to take a picture of these two, because they look great. A surprise here. Can you see both of them? Wow, this one is really fragile. There is a slug, two of them, eating the stem, so the stem got broken because of that. Uh, the good news is that the stem has no signs of worms, not at all. Two perfect summer tips here. So let's check the health. From this one I will only cut off the damaged parts from slugs. Clean it a bit. Beautiful summer tip. How about the second one? I think this one is also healthy. I mean, completely. Two perfect summer sips. Probably the best find of today. Always a nice feeling when suddenly 
such a beauty appears right in, in front of you. Again, a beautiful summer tip. An interesting find here. I think these should be the shattered wood tufts. Querneromyces mutabilis. So that's it for today's video guys. Here is the basket full of beautiful summer ceps that we have found. I'm very happy for that. They were in a good shape. I hope you enjoyed watching this video because it was pleasure for me making it. If you like this video and you would like to support this channel then please hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, share the video with your friends or check the links in the description. You can also check my Twitter, Instagram or Facebook. Thank you all for watching and see you next time. Bye bye.